Good afternoon and evening. I'm meteorologist Bo Dotson. It's about 340 and we've got some more snow showers moving in southeast Missouri. I wanted to mention that the low temperatures tonight, I did my best, just sent out a text message to all of you who subscribe to the forecast text. Some areas may be colder. I know the models in Mount Vernon are showing below zero. I went above that. We'll see. Maybe the models think there's more snow on the ground up there than there actually is. But just keep in mind, locally we could have some much colder air tonight than advertised. Now we do have this band of showers, snow showers, sorry, too cold for showers. We've got this band of snow showers. This is a pretty good burst, and this is going to uh, put down a, a little bit of a dusting of snow again on the roads as this moves eastward, a little bit southeastward, back into southern Illinois, far southeast Missouri, and parts of west Kentucky. We've still got snow flurries over southern Illinois and parts of west Kentucky. Everything's cold, temperatures in their 20s, so whatever falls will stick. Keep that in mind. As the sun goes down, we will have slick roads tonight in some areas. You already know this, that the side roads aren't in the best shape. Even some of the treated roads have had problems today. So we will have hazardous driving tonight where the snow does redevelop and fall. Not anticipating much accumulation, but another dusting or so certainly possible from this new band moving in. As we move into tomorrow, we'll keep an eye on the Boot Hill, West Tennessee, maybe the Kentucky, Tennessee border counties. The southern winter storm has nudged a little bit northward, not a lot, but maybe just enough to bring some more snow into the area late tonight into tomorrow morning, especially true for northeast Arkansas, perhaps the Missouri Boot Hill and northwest Tennessee. Again, low confidence because we're just not sure how far it would be on the northern fringe of it if it does occur and it'd be a burst of snow and could put down another coating as well on some of the roadways okay well we've got some cold nights ahead of us tomorrow night single digits likely across much of the area already looking at a warm-up we should rise into the 50s maybe 60s by tuesday with strong winds and showers and thunderstorms Seems like we're on a roller coaster pattern. This reminds me of December. And that was the forecast, a bit of a roller coaster this month, and we're certainly getting one. Have a good and safe evening. If you'd like to receive text messages, make sure you go to bodotsandweather.com or weathertalk.com. And if you choose the third text option, the social media updates, I will send you the winter weather updates along with the blog updates and Facebook updates on severe weather or winter storm days. There's also three other text options on the page and you can see those once you get there.